Mikey, and this is my mate Eli. Hope you're all enjoying the workshop so far. We've been learning a lot about emergencies. They can happen anywhere and anytime, and they come in all shapes and sizes. Emergencies are really serious situations where people can be in danger, badly hurt, or might need help. They can also be pretty scary. Depending on where you live, emergencies can become a big part of everyday life. Emergencies like to sneak up on us. That's why it's really important that we are all prepared to face an emergency when they appear. There are two great ways to be prepared. Learning how to stay calm and create an emergency kit. Being calm will help you make better decisions. Having an emergency kit will help to make sure you have what you need in an emergency. And once the emergency has passed, it's a great idea to talk with your household about what worked well and what you might do differently next time. That way, when another emergency appears, you'll have the important things you will need all ready to go. So, want to know how you can make your own emergency kit? Alrighty, I'll tell you. Ta-da! A pillow. A pillow? Oh, right, right. The pillow case. Yep. This right here is the secret to a great emergency kit. It's a big reason why we're here with you today. The Australian Red Cross wants you to join us and become part of the pillowcase program. You see, pillowcases aren't just for pillows anymore. A pillowcase in an emergency is your best friend. Oh, you too, Eli. Once you get rid of the pillow, you've just made yourself a carry bag. Look at the stuff you can put in there. And just like that, you have yourself your very own emergency kit. Using a pillowcase is a great idea, but we can't take credit for it. A while back, there was a mega storm called Hurricane Katrina that hit the east coast of America. Lots of people had to evacuate and move to safe ground. Some clever university students decided to carry their most important things in their pillowcases. A pillowcase? How cool is that? So cool, in fact, that Red Cross is giving pillowcases to kids all over the world. Yep, that includes you two. Of course, it's up to you how yours looks. It's fun to make them your own. But first, let's learn how we can stay calm in an emergency. Back to you in the workshop.